Now let's turn our attention to the ever-evolving relationship between Germany and China as they engage in high-stakes trade talks amidst mounting tensions. German Chancellor Olaf Scholz and Chinese Premier Li Keqiang recently emphasized the benefits of free trade between their nations. Scholz said that climate goals could be reached more easily with fair competition and open market access in China. Klar ist, für jedes Land dieser Welt wird es leichter, seine Klimaziele zu erreichen, wenn wir fairen Wettbewerb offenen Marktzugang und ein Level Playing Field zulassen. Schließlich fördert Wettbewerb Innovation. Wir alle kommen schneller voran mit der Transformation, wenn wir Technologien miteinander teilen, ohne befürchten zu müssen, dass Urheberrechte missachtet werden. Meanwhile, Lee warned that decoupling from China's economy would harm long-term growth globally. Amid the backdrop of negotiations, Germany's domestic intelligence agency issues a stark warning. They reveal China's relentless campaign to acquire German technology for military pur purposes raises concerns about national security and the growing threat of sophisticated cyber spying operations. As the trade talks unfold, the European Union launches its economic security plan seeking to strengthen controls on exports and emerging technologies that could potentially be used by rivals like China. The plan, which does not explicitly name China, but focuses on de-risking and reducing economic reliance on certain countries. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.